Bobby is one of those people behind the scenes that you don't see all the work he does to ensure that every child has a chance to play competitive tennis. I think we all have wonderful Bobby Curtis stories, but they probably involve being either yelled or screamed at by Bobby at a tennis event here or there, getting an entry in late by your child, or showing up at a tournament desk late. You know, Bobby has such a passion for tennis, he sometimes yells and screams at us, but I always tell people over the years, Bobby only yells and screams at the people he really cares the most about. For some of you that might not know Bobby that well, give you a little input about some of the things that Bobby really, really likes. Bobby really likes women, softball, Miami, Florida history, women, Florida tennis, softball, and women. You have influenced so many lives of players, parents, myself included, my own kids. What players have influenced you through the years? Well, obviously, all those kids that uh, that uh, become household names later by going on to play pro tennis or become college stars, obviously they influence me to some extent. Uh, but of course, you got all the all the kids, just just, just all of them. By dealing with them four, four or five different times each year, why, you got to know them pretty well, or they got to know you pretty well. I think we were one of the first offices to become an office uh, in a sense that we brought in to the office those kind of things that were still being done by volunteers maybe in other sections. I don't necessarily want to badmouth the other sections, but it seemed to me that I did hear that they, some of them were not as organized. An interesting thing, we set up a college scholarship uh, situation or information where I would send a form to college coaches and they would send information, send a form to the players getting ready for college. And then when either one asked for the other pile, you could, you could send it to them and it was sort of a bio of the school or a bio of the players. And that was a pretty neat thing. And the USJ finally picked it up and, and, and printed their college guide, which they still do every once in a while. So. Well, Bobby, I mean, as you know, he's been so involved in Florida Junior Tennis for such a long time, and, uh, you know, tennis is his passion, it's his life, and, uh, you know, I, I just, he's one of those guys, he's one of those good guys you remember from juniors, and we've, uh, we've stayed in touch, we've seen each other every year uh, at this event, and, um, you know, he, he's a good friend. Hey, you have a sense of humor. We know that from the commercial Saturday Night Live. Bobby has his own sense of humor. Funniest moment together with Bobby Curtis. Oh, that's easy. Uh, he, he brought, I remember the first time I had this event, I was 18 or 19. I just played well in the U.S. Open for the first time, and uh, you know I had some trophies from some tournaments I'd won. And he brought me like a 12 and under girls trophy to put in my collection in front of everybody. It was kind of embarrassing. Well, Bobby Curtis has been on the move all his life. Now it's Bobby Curtis Tennis on the Move by Andy Roddick Foundation. This is cool stuff. How did this all evolve? Well, uh, our board of directors of the Florida Tennis Association was looking for. Uh, a sponsor for this Tennis on the Move, which we had had for a number of years. And it's, uh, it's got all the equipment in that trailer behind us that uh, you can set up a, a, a kid zone in a parking lot or a schoolyard or a gymnasium. And uh, the Roddick Foundation uh, chose to, uh, to sponsor it. And Mrs. Roddick said that she'd like to have it named after me. So now it, instead of being just Tennis on the Move, it became Bobby Curtis Tennis on the Move, which is kind of flattering. When Andy did all of his junior tennis in Florida and 
Bobby Curtis was the instrument that provided all of the tournaments for Andy to go to, and he was always just so fair to all the kids that we knew that we wanted to do something back for Bobby. And we got an idea, and we talked to the USTA, and they helped us come up with this idea to sponsor the Bobby Curtis Tennis on the Move as Andy's thank you to Bobby for all the weekends that he, they have spent together. Well, I think a couple of things, the, uh, uh, the starting of junior team tennis, of course, is pretty close. And, uh, and then, of course, in Miami, helping start the Greater Miami Tennis Foundation, which still goes on. It was pretty neat. I'm afraid I can't say anything about that. But yes. <laughs> I'm saving that for the book. <laughs> the tell the tell all book that we're gonna make into a movie. <laughs> Bobby's just one of those rare people. To me, he is Florida tennis. For doing this for over 40 years, his his impact on the professional level of the players that have come out of Florida is immeasurable. He's had his handprint on so many great players by running the events that he runs for us in Florida tennis. Bobby, everyone knows and everyone knows you're a very special person. Thank you so much for all you've done. We love you.